Hey guys, MCake75 coming at ya. Just came back from the WWE house show in Charleston, which is coincidentally our closest local card shop as well. And as I told you, I was going to buy a hobby box, but I didn't, and for good reason, and I will show you later, so stay tuned. I also have a mail day, I have a couple of things from the WWE event, which is pretty sweet, and a couple cool little announcements, so, um, of course, I gotta get my boy, Dolph Zig, Dolph Ziggler, and there's his Sig, right there, pretty sweet. Then probably the nicest person that I met there was uh, Beth Phoenix, such a sweet person. She plays a big villain on TV, but don't let that fool you. She's great. I also met some other guys. I met um, Tenzai. He goes by Complete Tool Bag, seriously. And the announcer, Justin Roberts. Again, Complete Tool Bag. Very disappointed with them, but it's whatever. It was a good show all in all, and I really enjoyed it. So speaking of which, I went to the show, and... I go to this Wrestling Inc. site and I, I uh, participate in a lot of its stuff. It's the biggest uh, wrestling website, independent-wise, on the net. So I just sent an article and it says, yeah, you have a chance to win. Or not a chance to win, but a chance to be on the site if you post something worth it. So I sent it in. I sent in like this big, huge house report from the show. It actually got posted, so it's really cool. Um, it's under the Wrestling Inc. website and I think it's like another detailed report of the house show in Charleston, West Virginia. I'll supply the link for you, just so you can check it out. I thought it was really cool. But anywho, let's move on to the... Oh, wait, no. Let me, let me show you. Check out this uh, Dolph Ziggler shirt that I picked up, of course. It's not showing off. And then the back, of course, if you back it up. So that's pretty sweet. So let's move on to the cards. First, I'm going to do a live mail day break. Um, not from It's Kobe. Sorry. Um, I should probably be getting his any second, though, so I'll get to it. Let me figure out how to open this. Just give me a second. I think I am going to have to cut it, unfortunately. I hate doing that. So, I am very apprehensive to do this. How else am I supposed to open this one? Alrighty, hold on a second, folks. Maybe while I'm trying to figure this out, I will open what I got from the local card shop. So, maybe... Yeah, try that for me. Let me just show you some of the local card shop. and It's, it's pretty nice, really big stuff. So, um, First off, I got this because I didn't have it. It's a rookie of Allen Iverson. One of the few I didn't have, so I picked it up for pretty cheap from Skybox. It's a really neat set. So, like that. Oh, and by the way, remember, uh, I have my sub contest of 125. Just another update. You can win all that stuff. I don't think I have like 120, so five more subs and we'll do it. Get some people going. Make some vid responses. Do something uh, to get it going and try to win. Um, anyway, I picked up this next one. It's from 05, or, uh, 06 Tops Finest. It's a rookie auto of JJ Redick. Pretty, pretty sweet. Refracta. Um, not numbered, but cool. Next, all right, finally got it open. So let's go see what it is. Let's try this package real fast. And I'm pretty sure it's PC deal. So let's find out. It is. So that'll be the Stephen Curry. It's numbered 6 out of 24. Let's all finally reveal what it looks like. Dang, that's sweet looking. From this year's Limited, you will see more Limited Mojo later, so stick around. But from this year's Limited, it's Steph Curry Jumbo Jersey Autograph. And like I said, it's numbered 6 of 24. So that's awesome. Alright, next, didn't have an autograph of this dude, so I picked it up, figured why not, so it's from 2000, uh, Upper Deck, Pro Sign, and it is a Ray Allen on-card autograph, 
Celtics fans know him as a traitor. Heat fans know them as the next key to their success. So, anyway, it's on card. Very, very sweet. Obviously no number, but it is certified. So, really, really cool. Glad to finally pick up a Ray Allen autograph. Um, next one, let's get into the limited mojo. Here we go. Alright, so this one is numbered 48 of 49. Hard to see, but it's there. You see the player. I just revealed it. Whoops. But anywho. Trophy case autograph, Robert Parrish. It's my first Robert Parrish autograph, so I'm pretty excited about that. Very, very nice. So that was the first one. Next, again, uh, should I roll it? Let's use Taj Gibson. I think I might have just revealed it, but I'm going to slow roll it anyway. So it's limited SIGs. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Let's go this way. Autograph, if you probably recognize it, it's Kevin Love. Really sweet. Autograph of K-Love. It's numbered 15 out of 25. Really, really cool. So, my last one. Oh, here, I have a decoy. I'll slow roll this one, too. Uh, let's see, which way should I go across? It's glass cleaners. Can you see that? Glass cleaners. It is... Blake, Blake Griffin, and it is a jersey autograph of Blake. Pretty sweet card here. And it's last one made, you can call it your eBay one of one or whatever. 49 of 49, Blake Griffin, jersey auto from Limited, glass cleaners. So pretty nice there, great LCS recap. So guys, enter my sub contest. Keep on watching. I'll keep on performing and making. That's all I got for you today. Thank you for watching.